first Wolfenstow. It's where Alfred Hitchcock spent his school days dreaming up ways to scare us stupid. And where one of the world's finest picture palaces entertained Londoners for more than half a century. But when the listed EMD cinema shut down last year, it looked like curtains for good. But a determined battle led by the area's film fans means the big screen looks likely to return to Walthamstow. Emma Walden's keen to meet the screensavers. There's not much that makes Walthamstow different to any other town centre. There's your usual estate agents, solicitors and, of course, a curry house. But there is one building that really stands out on this high street. It may not look like much now, but this used to be the jewel in the neighbourhood crown. There were once 50 picture palaces in Waltham Forest. None were as grand as this. None of them survived. And until a few weeks ago, it looked like the EMD had also buttered its last popcorn. In recent years, the cinemas passed through various hands, not all of them wholly dedicated to the interests of local cinema lovers. In 2002, it was bought for £2.8 million by the Universal Church of the Kingdom of God, a remarkably wealthy Brazilian-based Christian sect. Owners of other converted cinemas in the capital, they wanted to transform the EMD into an East London venue for showbiz-style preaching. But film fans didn't want faith healing here, just the offerings of the silver screen. As hundreds attended the cinema's closing night, a legal battle was commencing. And in the meantime, movie lovers found solace at the local pub. We organised the campaign to lobby the local authority to refuse planning permission for that. And uh, that was successful and uh, the local authority turned down the, 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 uh, the church. This was a very determined campaign. I mean, what was it about this cinema that made you want to keep it as that? It's the only major entertainment venue in the area and it's a very unique one. It's um, a very beautiful building. Um, it has a long and illustrious history. Um, an awful lot of, uh, of the great stars of the last century appeared there. The Beatles played there, Frank Sinatra played there, the Rolling Stones played there. A whole list of people, basically anybody who was anybody between about 1930 and the mid-70s um, has played there. So it's got a great, great heritage and also it's very well loved by local people. The EMD is now on the market for £1.4 million with the proviso that it must remain a cinema and live entertainment venue. I'm hoping to attract some of those big names back again. That would be wonderful. Rolling Stones in Walthamstow. Quite possibly. Well, you have to hope there'll be a suitably Hollywood ending. Emma Walden, London Tonight, Walthamstow. Hmm.